this next exercise it's not really so much of an exercise as it is a concept of grip control and how the grip on the stick should actually be applied. Uh, I was taught through a drum instructor who was a marching and drum corps teacher. So the concept can both be applied for both traditional and matched grip. Uh, there is a fulcrum on the drumstick which is usually uh, about one third to uh, just behind the balance point of the drumstick. And uh, if you create the fulcrum right there, these other fingers then become more of a stop of the lever to control height of the bounce or height of the drumstick. Rather than using solely a wrist with a tight grip, the fingers can become quite the actual use of containment for the height or adjustment for the height, being playing loud or soft for height being just using the fingers, it's simply controlled that way. Um, the idea being to have your hands flat for the mashed grip and play without moving of too much of the arm and using strictly a finger and wrist concept. You, this idea of staying like this with the wrist flat is going to allow you to drop the stick less often because you have such a tight overhand grip on it and the fingers are there to keep it against falling from uh, against gravity. Um, in the traditional grip, you can squeeze <clears throat> in between these two fingers, creating your fulcrum that way, and the lever is then, as it bounces, it comes up off of there and falls back down to it. And then the fulcrum shifts to the back here. But either way, grip is very important and Using the Vic Firth sticks always helps. Uh, consistency in the feel of a stick is very important to me, and uh, I feel that Vic Firth absolutely makes the best balance, best weight, the best feel for me. That's why I have a signature stick. It's actually the size equivalency of a 5A with a nylon tip on it for definition. Uh, if you can't find the signature stick at your stores, you can certainly ask for it, and they can order it, uh, or you can order it on the computer online at www.vicfirth.com.